Hello Internet World, Techno Guy 3 for non-techno. Now you've seen my Nerd Cave tour. If you haven't, click here. Now you've seen my Nerd Cave tour, but I haven't shown you the tools that I use in my workshop. That's what this is. If you're going to work on computers, the first and most important thing you need are basic tools. A screwdriver set is necessary to even think about opening up a computer. If you're working on a desktop, it's essential to have a monitor, keyboard, and mouse to use. After removing screws, it's helpful to have a place to put them. I have a magnetic screw holder for that purpose. In case you drop any screws, a telescoping screw retriever is good for picking them up, and a magnetic light allows you to see inside the case easily. You'd be surprised how dirty computer systems can get, so keep some cleaning wipes or something similar handy. Sometimes I use electrical tape to tape down loose cables or connectors also. Speaking of which, always make sure you have access to spare cables and adapters. A few shelves full of spare parts never hurts either. You'll need a test bed machine to test drives and power supplies. Keep a speaker or two at your desk in case the need to test audio output arises. Oh, and to avoid having to swap out power supplies all the time, I recommend buying a tester. For CPU and heatsink swaps, thermal paste is a must. For the adventurous, you may want to look into soldering. Nothing is more satisfying than having a circuit board function after replacing a bad capacitor or two. You'll need a soldering iron, some way to hold boards, and a multimeter. If your multimeter doesn't have a capacitance reading, you'll need a separate device. You'll also need the basics, solder, desoldering braid, and a solder sucker. The most important repairs computer techs do are in software, however, so don't take it for granted. For that, I have a flash drive full of repair tools and a CD case full of Windows OEM disks. For more on that, click here to see the full video I did on software repair tools.